My name's Bob Saad. I'm the inventor of the 24 game in the First in Math program. Now let me show you the successes you can have when you use First in Math in an intentional way. Marvine Elementary is a Title I school in Bethlehem. In fact, half of their schools are high poverty. Marvine, 96% of the students are on free reduced lunch. Before they latched onto the goals index, they were ranked last among the 16 elementary schools. They got a new young principal, big advocate of first in math, focused on the goals index, and within one year, they were number one within the district. You look at the three fourth grade classrooms at Marvine, all had relatively high goals index. You look at the VIF's data for fourth grade, 93.2% address subtraction, 75% of those fourth grade children in that Title I school could multiply any two double digit numbers. When the data came out, they had a whopping 33% jump in students scoring proficient above on the Pennsylvania state standardized tests. Across all tested grades, over a two year period, Marvine had a 25 percentage point increase. This has all been documented by Lehigh University in a peer reviewed published study. Marvine received the Distinguished School Award from the Pennsylvania Department of Ed and in 2020, received the coveted National Blue Ribbon Award. Only one of 367 schools out of 100,000 schools nationwide to receive this distinction. You wanna make a real impact on math achievement? You need a program that's affordable, sustainable, enjoyed by children year after year. Because for them to master mathematics, they need that time. We were in the school district of Philadelphia, district-wide, more than 100,000 students, grades three to eight. Over a nine-year period, every single year, they had increases in percentage of students scoring proficient above on the Pennsylvania state standardized tests. We work in Anne Arundel County, Maryland, very large, 85 elementary schools. Maryland City is another Title I school. Last year, students solved 3.8 million math problems. You look at the VIF's data for fourth grade, 73.8% of the students address the Achilles heel of subtraction. Our goal is to not only help build foundational math skills in students, we want to help you transform the culture of your school. Because if you transform the culture into one of engagement, success, growth, everything becomes easier.